So it's been uh, at least a couple of months, if not you know, be more since I've done the last video. And it's been a couple of months since I've interrupted testosterone. Um, yeah, I haven't noticed any regression. Um, I've decided to let my fish wear growth again. So you can see I have a fair bit of growth here under my chin. The sides, not that much still. A little bit of stash, very thin. Yeah, I mean, not much more, obviously, because I interrupted testosterone, but there was quite a development there beforehand. I decided I will go back on uh, on testosterone um, just because I would like to get a bit more facial hair. This is very puny kind of hair, and I would like it to get a bit more thick on the side of my face here. So, yeah, I decided to resume. Also, I would like to have a bit more bottom growth and that's also stopped and if I can get a bit more of that, I'll be happy. And if my voice could deepen even a bit more, I'll be definitely happy with that. So yeah, I would like a bit more masculinization. So I've decided that we resume. I've um, contacted my medical provider, so I'm waiting for them to update my prescription so I can <coughs> Um, start with testo gel again and also because I'm having problem with very high levels of estrogen which is really not good for my general well-being and um, I'm taking some progesterone anyway still and the doctor um, supervision progesterone to try and <laughs> lower down this sky high estrogen that I got going on and um, hopefully once I resume testosterone, the combination of the progesterone and the testosterone together will be able to finally lower the estrogen in my body. Um, yeah, my main concern and why I decided to stop testosterone was I felt like I was starting to lose a fair bit of hair on my head and I started to be of a freak out on the idea of balding. I don't want to bold, but I still have a lot of hair on my head. So I think probably I kind of <coughs> jumped the gun a bit too quickly. I think I can safely um, take testosterone for a bit longer without having to worry about going bald yet. So for now, this will be my course of action. Also, great update. Uh, I got a top surgery date. So it's going to be the 2nd of February 2023. So it's just over a month from now, which I'm really, really excited about. Also be scared, I have to be honest, because obviously uh, I never had surgeries in my life. I mean, I'm 42 years old and I've been so lucky. I really praise the universe that I never needed any surgery. And... Uh, so yeah, there's a little bit of apprehension in terms of being put under general anesthesia and um, but I mean I'm sure everything will be fine and um, yeah I'm just so excited to finally have a flat chest just in time for next summer. So yeah, really looking forward to that and yeah, but yeah, this video was just um, pretty much to document the fact in the, that in these two months of uh, interrupted testosterone I didn't feel like I had any kind of regression or any feminization happening. I mean the only thing is really the mood. I've been crying a lot more than I was when I was on testosterone but this is also due to the very high estrogen level that I have which um, yeah it's above it's well above you know, what should be a normal range so trying to address that now also because I have some large um, uterine fibroids and they feed on estrogen so it's just making it all a pain for me at the moment but hopefully we'll manage to sort it out I don't know if eventually I may have to take some um, <coughs> blockers because my, my, my body is just not it's just not getting the message that this estrogen is got to go and is that it seems like it's fighting quite hard to 
pump it into my body so yeah but yeah so I will make uh, probably a video after my surgery at this point and um, yeah I don't know exactly what to call this video but I guess it's just a quick update um, between the last time when I just interrupted testosterone and now there has been two months without testosterone but yeah the next update I should be quite excited with the flat chest anyway